Well, hello, everybody. <laughs> this is my third time trying to make this video because I just don't have the words today for it. And I want to make sure that I'm fair. So here we go. My official opinion of Sample Tank 4. I have two opinions. One is for the beginner, very straight up. If you are a beginner and you're just starting to make music and you don't have a huge budget to go around and hand pick and hand shop because you've never really tried all the instruments, you're not sure what you're into, what you want to get into, or even your technical prowess and how much you want to invest in this hobby, it's great. Get it. Just go ahead and get it. Because that way, if you don't like it or if you if you just don't like music recording or wh whatever you do, you'll have fun with it and you'll have sounds that are good enough to make yourself happy and make just make a really, really nice sounding presentation. You could make... There's a really, really nice sounding presentation. Um, awesome learning experience. You have a visual of LFOs and synthesis and samples and you dive into key switches and you're bouncing tracks and you have mixers and you have all these things. You have a taste of arpeggiators and all that great stuff. Just a wonderful, wonderful, cool thing. Boom. Beginners. Now let's talk about me and all my boys out here and girls that are sitting here going kind of what the fuck. Not impressed. I've heard this shit. And I think that a lot of people agree that this workstation kind of, you get a whiff of 2005, 2010. And it just kind of feels like compared to, I mean, just the GUI alone. Um, we all know that most of the instruments we use from Native Instruments and other manufacturers, Spectrosonics, they just sound better than this. Just heads and tails better. Everything. Um, especially the guitars and horns and monophonic instruments like that. And these sounds just aren't up to par, really, most of them. Maybe 20% maybe hit the mark. Um, but most of them, no. No. Not at all. And uh, sadly, I think for us, it's a miss. And if you're not upgrading for 199 bucks, and or if you're already invested in NI, or you've already handpicked, as I have, my favorite instruments that I use in every project, this is something you could really do without. Wirecat, I'll see you later.